Christmas Eve, my friends. Welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. It is Christmas Eve for me, December 24th, and I am still getting ready. I have done my hair, showered, all that, but I have not put any makeup on. We are going to be heading out to the Christmas Eve service in a couple hours, and so I'll be getting ready before then. But I wanted to go ahead and open the vlog and say good morning, Merry Christmas Eve. Um, I know it's already passed for everyone, but I still like love looking back at all our Christmas videos so I'll be vlogging today and I'll also be vlogging tomorrow and they will be separate vlogs so last year I put them together this year I'm not there's just a lot going on and I figured it's fun for me to have two short little vlogs to remember you know all the fun things we did on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day so my kids went out to my mom's house my sister Angela who I've gotten a lot of comments on lately that she looks and acts just like Patrick and yes she does I have twin sisters. They are identical twins and they're 13 months younger than me. And Angela is the one that's way more outgoing than Andrea. Andrea is the one that's married with a ton of kids that lives in the Bahamas. But Angela is single and she's just like the crazy fun aunt. So every year for Christmas Eve for the last eight years, she has put on this huge cousin Christmas party and everything is huge with Angela. It's got to be, memories have to be made, traditions have to be made, like she is all about it. And so she does this amazing cousin Christmas party. And when she started, my, all the kids were really little and they've all grown up now. So she's had to kind of like scale back. They used to do all kinds of arts and crafts and games and they did, my mom would always bake cookies for everyone. They would read the Christmas story. They exchanged gifts. They, it's just, it's just an all out cousin crazy Christmas party for like three hours every Christmas Eve. And it gives the parents time to do any wrapping, any shopping, any last minute things. And so it's always been wonderful for us as well as them. And it's always like her gift to them. So this year is a little scaled back only because the kids are all getting older. And so they're gonna, you know, just listen to music and have fun and see cousins and exchange gifts and have food and all those things. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. But they just left for that Madison pick Jackson up and they're gonna head over there. And it's from 12.30 to 3.30. And then at 4 o'clock is our candlelight service at church. So we're going to all meet over at the church afterwards. And then we do have a Christmas Eve tradition that started many years ago. Many years ago. We would all go to the local hibachi all-you-can-eat buffet place. It's just something we did one time and it became tradition. And so my family will be going over to that, but our family will not because Michael and Danielle are spending Christmas Eve with us instead of Christmas Day, just trying to make sure they get to see everyone. So we'll come back here and I'm making some dinner. I need to go ahead and get some of that done. And then we'll exchange gifts with them. And our family Christmas Eve tradition is, if you've watched before, you know, I'll link those Christmas Eve videos down below from previous years, but we always do gingerbread houses. We do a little contest with them, and then we get new pajamas, and we watch old Christmas episodes of Family Ties. It's just something that we started many years ago and became tradition, and we never watch them except on Christmas Eve, and my kids are all about it. They actually get more excited for Christmas Eve than they even do Christmas Day, so that's the plan for tonight. We um, So Elena and Andrew are coming over and Michael and Danielle and then we're going to all be at church and then we'll come here and have dinner and presents and all those fun things. And then tomorrow is Christmas so that will be a separate vlog tomorrow for Christmas. Well in tomorrow's video I'll give you a rundown of that day. But I went ahead and brought up the gifts for the gifts exchange tonight for Michael and Danielle. We're going to, you know, exchange with them. And then also Christmas pajamas for the two kids that are not married. I'm not, I don't get the married's new pajamas, just the other ones. Madison is spending the night here tonight, so that will be fun. But um, I'm going to go ahead and make it easy on myself tonight. I'm not doing like a huge dinner. We actually talked about getting pizza, but I just wasn't sure if pizza places would be open. So... I thought, you know what, I'm going to have a backup. Marion's home. He took the puppies home that you saw in my last video. He just took them back home. But I'm going to uh, just make some meatballs in the crock pot. If you, uh, Everyone's heard of this recipe, but if you haven't, just some chili sauce and grape jelly with meatballs. I'm going to put them on low for probably five to six hours. And uh, we're going to have like some charcuterie boards, you know, simple fruits and veggies and meat and cheese crackers and then we have like some desserts I made these cookies again last night and then I made my delicious delicious <laughs> chocolate chip cookies if you missed that video it was the one before this I know they don't look like much they look like thin and burnt 
The flavor is so good. They literally taste like I'm eating, it's better almost than like a Toll House chocolate chip cookie because it's got the almond flour when you bake it. Oh, so, so good. So anyway, we have plenty of desserts. And so I need to go ahead and get the food in the crock pot now because it is 12.22. Their party starts at 12.30. I think my sister and her husband are gonna stop over because they're kid free for a few hours too. So we're just gonna visit and then we'll leave in about three hours to head over to church. everything pre prepped for tonight um, the meatballs are still cooking I went ahead and turned it up to high um, I had it on low I guess two hours and now it'll or no only like an hour and then it'll be on high for four to four and a half hopefully they don't burn I'll, I'll turn it down if I need to but i um, not gonna do this until later because Elena might be bringing some meat and some cheese I didn't want to put all that out because some of her stuff can't touch other stuff you know so I'm gonna let her do that, but I did do the fruit and vegetable trays and then I went ahead and browned some sausage and some bell pepper because tomorrow morning, I don't wanna have to do that in the morning. I'll just be able to, um, you know, assemble. I think I'm gonna do little, instead of like a breakfast casserole because Marion and I are the only ones that are gonna eat it. Jackson and Madison won't eat it. They don't even want like eggs. So I'm um, just gonna do individual like muffin cups with eggs, sausage, and then some white cheddar and they'll be kind of like low carb and yeah i don't think i'm going to add potato but we're going to do that in the morning and then i do have to fry some bacon uh, in years past when the kids were younger we used to get up and do presents first and then as soon as presents were over i had to go start making food and that was just exhausting or else sometime i would get up before and make the food put it in the oven and then we'd do presents and then we would eat but Either way, it's a lot of work for mom. So the last couple years, we've just all gotten up and all helped make breakfast, and then we eat, and then we do gifts, and it just works a lot better for me. So, uh, sorry, my TV's loud. White Christmas is on, it's one of my favorites. I only saw it the first time a few years ago, and I love it, and I haven't watched it this year yet, so. But anyway, um, so we're gonna have, Jackson asked for pig bacon, he said, because I always do turkey bacon, so I'm gonna do real bacon and also turkey bacon and then i'll make the egg cups and then either monkey bread or cinnamon rolls mike jackson and madison requested both or they each requested one so i don't know i might have them madison can make the monkey bread it's kind of a lot more work than the cinnamon rolls so anyway my lips are so chapped i need to go put some chapstick on but i'm waiting i think my sister's going to stop by for a little while and then we're going to head up to church in like two hours so i'll probably just vlog when we're there, we always have a beautiful uh, candlelight service and um, I won't see my family tonight after, you know, after the service because they're gonna all, all of our families have like our own Christmas Eve traditions. So we kind of all go back to our own houses and do our own little things with our family. And then we wake up in the morning and do the same thing. And then we get together later. So that is what's gonna happen tonight, but I'll take you all with us and hopefully share all our Christmas Eve traditions.
porch was beautiful and the sunset was beautiful. Did y'all see that sunset when you were leaving? Oh my word, it was beautiful. Danielle has a few little beggars right here. We're just throwing these together. We have meat and cheese, just crackers, cookies, fruit and veggies, and then meatballs over here. They look good. They cooked really good. And then we have some Hawaiian rolls and all our sparkling ciders. We're just gonna have an easy meal so that no one has to be in the kitchen for hours today. Marion, that is so you. <laughs> I picked it out. That's why I didn't it. The fact that I she understood it amazes it. me. I'm so excited. Oliver wants to it's help. Throw, throw it's avocado. Race. It's a race. Go. Just don't Oliver. show each other. Oliver. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Those are so cute. I heard about them, but I haven't seen them. That's so okay, cute. now turn them around. Oh my gosh, those are so cute. And they have your ears. You, aww. Holly. <laughs> Keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're Everything will be okay Cause all I wanna do is spend this holiday with you Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you I longed for this moment to have you for myself In a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else I've decorated Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me Another year went by, but the difference this time Is that ever since July, I've been happier than I have ever been It's safe to say that my love for you is true Tomorrow it is Christmas
houses are done. We've labeled them one through five. Ha ha! And we FaceTimed with my sister and my nephew and they gave us a winner. So I'll show you all the houses and the winner. Or I'll give you the order of winners that they say. So Jackson's house got fifth place. This is Michael and Danielle's with the little corgi. Is that not the cutest? They brought a different kind. So they got fourth place. Elena and Andrew got third. I love the snow on the front. Thank you. And then Madison got second place. And Ed, Marion, and I got first place. We win. <laughs> that was fun. Airbender. Missed water. Missed <laughs> pump. Water pump. <laughs> You can crash an accident. I think it was a couple of blue Blink. Blink. Girls Blink. Against Guys. That blank you went. Let's do Girls Blink. Against Guys. Yeah, your blink was You were like, who oh, <laughs> idiot? Was... Thinking, dreaming, mind, not know, thought, unknown, you ask, questions, bike, riding, tricycle, bike. Tickle, what? <laughs> bike. Oh, pathway, park, um, person, what? Bike, have bell on it. <laughs> they have bell on it, on bike. Kids, kids toy, what? <laughs> I don't know, um, uh, <laughs> you put your hand on bike. Horn, bike horn. Oh, what oh. on the horn? in their pajamas. I actually got this at Goodwill. Got these at Old Navy a couple years ago. Jackson's got his new pajamas. They have like video games and they're real thick and warm and he really loves warm pajamas. <sighs> anyway, Elena got this shirt from Madison. So cute, <laughs> so cute. So she put, oh, and her Christmas pajama pants. Mm -hmm. Old Navy. Old Navy. And we're gonna watch our uh, family ties we bought three christmas episodes and we watch them every christmas eve so that's what we're gonna do now it is 10 o'clock so got the kitchen all cleaned up everybody's getting a snack for the for the shows marion's getting his pajamas on and we're gonna watch and after that i'm gonna say good night so thanks for hanging out with us tonight i hope that you enjoyed this christmas eve vlog for us tomorrow's christmas day obviously so i will have a, another whole vlog of that so be looking for that but make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. You know I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.